What's up, y'all? Toasted Ted here once again. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Deserted Zombie Survival. This will be episode 20 and the last episode of season 5. Um, I probably won't make any more for season 5 simply because I'm just going to wait for season 6 when update 6 comes out or whatever update that number is going to be. I think it's 6. Yeah, it is 6. Um, anyway, yeah, that's my plan. I was going to go do the finishing touches, like the actual finishing, because I forgot the spike traps around my base. So i got to find a car and go there, which, let me check the map. Yeah, I need to go to that little bit up there, to the top right, that police station over there. I think that's it. Isn't it? Police station right over here should be my my uh, base. I do believe. And if not, then I don't know. Pretty sure I made it over this police station. Yeah. Okay. But yeah. What I want to do this episode, uh, especially since it's in the daytime, want to uh, put all the spike traps down. I need to, which I'm pretty sure. One of my other builds that I did recently, and um, Negan, I think, had the same spike traps that I'm about to do, so it's nothing new, I guess, but this is the kind of base that I'll probably keep. Like, uh, I remade my Season 5 map, which was the second map, and I remade it and called it Season 5 and 6, so, like, um, when Season 6 does come out, I'll just keep this map, or keep this, you know... A saved map, if you will. And, um, uh, of course, it's nighttime now. Wait, no, I think I got a bed in here. I can sleep. I'll sleep and go through the day that way. Or go back to day that way. But anyway, um, yeah, if that's the case and, uh, like it doesn't wipe when season six comes out or when updates, I keep going in season, but when update six comes out and, it doesn't wipe, which I hope it doesn't, then I will uh, most definitely keep this in this map and continue playing on it. You know what I mean? Especially if there's updates in terms of stuff about the map and stuff like that. Okay, I don't remember exactly how many pillars I used, but I want one per pillar out there, so... 150 at 5, it's only 30. That's all the wood I have? Ouch. I don't think 30 is going to be enough, but we'll see. I'm... Uh-oh. My bag is filled. I don't have a storage box yet? Oh, wow. Alrighty. Um, well. Wow, I can't make that either. The bag's still full. Put that down for now. I thought I, I could have swore I had a storage box in here somewhere. That's weird. All the rest of these in the spike walls should be 29 now, I guess, instead of 30, which that sucks. 28. Huh. That's weird. Yeah, I won't be able to grab that now. It sucks. <laughs> but, um, here, I got to eat something first because the game will force me to eat first before I sleep anyway. Need another one. Sleep. <laughs> now that it's daytime, eat again. Blip, blip, blip. Now,
Yeah, I definitely did this in another video. I remember doing it now, but... Oh, well. This is a good setup, honestly. In terms of the spike wall. I mean, even though it's not completed, like it's like not every square inch of the outer wall is covered by these spikes. It's enough of it to make a difference. Like if you're getting chased by some zombies, you can run inside here, inside the walls. And because they're dumb, they'll try to like walk through the wall and act like they don't know there's a wall there. You know what I mean? They won't just go around to the door. But um, when they do that, then like, you know, 50-50 shot, they might run into one of these. And if they do, it'll kill them. If it's a normal zombie. If it's those big N-type dudes, the giants, I call them N-types. If you haven't heard me say that, that's why I call them that. Because they're the player's nemesis. And because nemesis is a enemy most likely trademarked, I don't want to name it that, but it is a nemesis to the player. Like an actual one, the definition of nemesis. You know what I mean? Anyway, that's why I call them N-types, if you're ever curious for why. Which I think I've explained that before anyway, but you know, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I put one of these every single pillar. And then obviously if I had enough wood, I can make 28 more, or 30 more, whatever. I'd make enough more to uh, put one in between each one of these now. You know what I mean? Which maybe at the start of season six, that's the first thing I'll do to complete my wall. Or maybe in between... In between seasons, I'll do that just to have something to show for the off season, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, if if the game wipes altogether, but there's like a decent little update to part of one of the maps or something like that, I might restart a game in whatever map is updated. You know what I mean? Instead of keeping, because I mean, if it wipes anyway, then I'm not just going to restart and build this again, because that was a lot of wood. If that does happen, then I might just dupe up the wood real quick. Okay, I need one, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. I only need 30 wood. That's not bad. That's only five trees. I bet I could get that right now, actually. Go. I didn't really uh, gather a whole lot of trees on this map itself. I went to the Lumberjacks. Or no, I think I called it Lumberjackal. <laughs> or something like that. But uh, I go to that map, and it's literally just a map that I go to just to collect wood when I'm not recording. Like, it's just uh, that's all I do in it. Like, I didn't build nothing or anything like that. Oh, yeah, I forget you get 12 per tree. For some reason, I was thinking 6 per tree. Yeah, so right there's, I only need 30, and right there's 24 already, so. I get half of this one, and I'll have what I need. All right, now I'll go back, make the other six that I need, and that will be my actual completed base after that. But I want to show you something also, which I think I did in another video on my other base for uh, Negan. But, like, inside here, how the wood keeps going in, if it was on top of this concrete area, or the gray part or whatever, you could put pillars on it and then build a roof from the wall I just built to the blue part up there. So you could just get on top of the roof real easy and stuff like that if you wanted. But obviously, I didn't uh, prepare enough, which that sucks, but oh well. I made eight. Crap. I only meant to make six. Anyway, um... I kind of do want to destroy these because they're a little too close to my front door. Like, I don't want to accidentally hit them.
I'm going to try to give you wood back. It's weird. <sighs> well, yeah, if you're doing what I'm doing, I I would suggest putting them far enough away from your front door, like this right here, to where there's like a big old gap that you can easily get through. You know what I mean? But there's still one there. Like, that's a pretty good gap, the one I just made and left. And this here, we'll just complete it. Clink. And right, y'all. Right, y'all. Yeah, it's much easier to build in this view, too, I think. Over here. Yeah, nice. Did end up using every one of them. That's cool. But yeah, the police station doesn't have a back entrance, so I don't. That's the only reason I don't have a back door, which I could make a back door because like pretty much now the perimeter is my own and not um, limited by the building itself. You know what I mean? So that's pretty cool, I guess. I could make a back door, but I don't know. Instead of making a back door, I might make like a ladder going up over the wall. Wait, I don't know if I have enough wood. I don't think I have enough wood now. Yeah. Crap. Well, hmm. Wow, 243 planks. That's why I don't have enough wood right there. <laughs> that sucks. I'll put those planks in here so I don't have to carry them at least. But yeah, um, let's put a tack light. And this is seven. No, it's a five. A five will work. Five works on every gun. Every gun that can use a scope, you can use a five scope. You know, most guns that you can use a scope, you can use a seven also. So if I find a seven, I'll probably replace that five with it. But yeah, I keep forgetting. Like, which character I'm playing and why I have so many different weapons. And I'm like, oh, wait, no, I'm Toasted Ted, actually. So, <laughs> you know, it's odd. I don't know. That's the only bad thing about having so many different games and characters going. It's like, eesh. But, yeah, if I get uh, before Season 6, I'll complete it. Like, I'll get enough wood to, instead of, like, having a ladder on this side, of the building, you know what I mean? I'm gonna probably put one only over here. Like, cause the front door is there and I'll probably put one here like right there or something like that. Cause I know the spike traps are in between the pillars or on the pillars. So if I put one in between, it should be good. But, um, yeah. That's about it for this uh, episode and this season, so hopefully this doesn't wipe and this here completed, or 99.98% .98 completed at least, um, base will be finished. And if it does wipe, then I might either go with the original map just to see what the differences are in the update, because I'm more familiar with that one, or whatever map gets changed, like I said earlier. Anyway, if you liked the video, uh, give it a like, uh, leave your comments down below, and stay tuned for more. And as soon as update six comes out, season six will start. I'll come out with an update video about all the info that at least I figured out about it, you know. I'll read it and play a little bit and then see what the, because uh, a lot of times the notes will say something like, oh, this, this zombie got you know, stronger or whatever like that, you know what I mean? Which I can't, I don't know if that's ever said that before, but if it said something like that, these enemies get stronger. The exploder enemies explode faster when they, you know, instead of detonating late, they detonate earlier or something. I'll uh, read it and then play a little bit 
so you could see an example if, in case you haven't seen one of my update videos yet. Anyway, um, yeah, stay tuned for more and thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. This is Toasted Ted, and I'm out.